Oh, okay. Now he, he looks like he's about ready to jump down onto the tracks. What's going on? I don't... Oh. Uh-oh. Welcome back, Super Toe fans, for the final Where To Now of 2020. And today, I believe we are doing the... Let's see. We're going to the Bronx. That's right. Going to the Bronx. Per Eric McLean, you can read it for yourself, but I chose this one because it has a lot of transfers, they're not very long rides, and go takes me places that I've never been before. I have not been to some of these stations. So, not taking the bus, sorry. Not like last time I went to the Bronx. Do I want to take the IND, or do I want to take the BMT? Well, obviously, it's going to be the BMT, because that's what the L is. All right. L. We're going to just one stop to Union Square. Hey, that's a good sign. One swipe, first try. East side, Brooklyn. That's right, we want to go toward Brooklyn. That's, oh my gosh. Wow, they re definitely selectively rehabilitated the L line. Oh, by the way, here's a little hat reveal. Yep, that's right, the GoGo -Go Super Toe hat is available at gogosupertoe.com. It's a little five panel hat. I kind of, there's the uh, youth sizes for the baseball cap. Eh, focus. Says Go Go Super Toe in the back, but you can't see it because the camera won't focus. Anyway, I like everything about this hat. The only thing that kind of bothers me is that this little tab, this little, uh, the extra, you know, tightener thing doesn't tuck into a little, it doesn't tuck in on the back. It just sort of hangs there, and that annoys me. But other than that, it's a pretty good quality hat. I like it. And uh, that's the hat I'll be wearing on my trips from now on. So there it is. L train. Good old R160C L train, which we've seen before. All right. And we get an R160 reg. Regular R160 train. Cool. Get it? L -S -E. That doesn't really work. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And that's where we're going. We're going to transfer there for the queue, which we've been on many times before. So let's get on to Union Square, which we've been to many... Hey, they turned off. Listen to the... What's going on? Okay, there. Just lit up. I guess the L couldn't quite figure out where it was going next. Interesting. Okay, so now it knows. The computer knows where... Wait... Okay, there. Okay, Canarsie. Okay, cool. So the computer knows, so we're good. As long as the computer knows where we're going, right? <laughs> anyway. Alright, so the Q train, I gotta go up and around. Pretty sure. Broadway line and street, okay. The, um, the Q train. Anyway, 14th Street's kind of, it's easy to find your way around. There's no tutorial necessary. The sign, it's very well signed here at Union Square, but uh, the, it's kind of circuitous as far as how to get to different train platforms. I'm glad they built this area to hook them all together. All right, so that is an R46N train that I will not be taking, and I'm toes crossed that I can actually get a, oh, hey. Ooh, a performer. Check my wallet here. Yeah. I really got to make it a habit to bring some some ones and stuff to listen to these performers for a couple of minutes and give them some money for their time because they're, you know, these musicians and performers are just a treasure. Most of them. I miss Showtime. I really do. I'm pretty sure they outlawed it or something. Uh, uh, well, it's the. I don't have time to wait for another queue, so I'm gonna take it. Fortunately, it's only two stops. Bye, Mr. Performer. I didn't even see where you. Didn't even see your face. Where? Oh, there you are. You're over here. Is there a window? Seems like there should be a window right here. Thought there was... Anyway, whatever. There he is. There's Mr. Performer Man. 
All right, let's get on. Hello, everyone. Okay. You're welcome. Yes, I agree. Let's keep the nation healthy, not just New York. Wear your masks. Seriously, as far as lots of people, like almost everybody I see in New York is wearing a mask. Okay, this is not where I'm getting. Anyway. Oh, yeah, transfers available to the path train. Wait a minute, why is he making. Oh, this is a 46. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought I was still on the L train, the R160. Huh, if only. Anyway, have you guys noticed that, like, not a lot of people are walking around coughing and sneezing and stuff? Let's get all the trip. I'm at least glad I can understand this guy. The 46 announcements, our 46 announcements are are so often like the like they show in the movies and cartoons and comedies where it goes like that's really how it sounds a lot of the time. But that dude was very clear, and the speakers actually worked in the car I was in. So, yay that one, that particular R46. Oh, it's a huge inventory blowout, 70% out. Oh, yay, cool. That was a sporting goods store or something. Oh. Is there only one S? Whoa, look how new. Wow. Great job, MTA, on this so far. Look at it go. Look at him go. Nice. All right. That's going to be a, once it's finished, that's going to be a nice little addition, nice little uh, renovation. Wait a minute, they replaced the one here too? Wow! I wonder if the train cars are quieter because of the new tracks. Actually, it looks like... No, there's brand new tracks. That, that one down the middle is just the old tracks that they need to pick up, I guess. Do they have a machine? Hey, the, the inventory blowout guys are here waiting for the one train with me. Do they have a machine that comes in, like a crane that comes and picks those heavy, heavy, heavy rails up? I would hope so. All right, there's the one train. Doesn't doesn't sound any quieter. Doesn't doesn't sound any quieter. But it, I think I don't think it's so much about noise as about uh, smoothness. And unfortunately, this is not feelovision, so you're not gonna feel how smooth this is. Let's see if I. I mean, if if the camera doesn't bump, it's got a you know it's on a gimbal, so even if it is rough, you can't really see how rough it is anymore. Not with this camera. This one, yep, DJ, DJI Osmo Pocket, the first edition. And also, don't forget, Super Toe, Super Toe Reflections wearing the Super Toe hat. Go, go, Super Toe Reflection hat. 50th is not where we gotta get off at Times Square and transfer to the A, because we are Bronx bound. Da Bronx. Gross. Why is there a. Seriously. That looks like dog poop. Why do you. Makes me, it makes me a little bit angry. Like, it feels like... Uh, yeah, I don't want to talk about that. That's, that's just annoying. Hey, look. Bombardier made non-lemons. Non like, these one trains have been running forever. See? An R62A? Yep. Good old, reliable Bombardier before the R179s. And a properly covered emergency brake. That's awesome. Good job, Bombardier, on this one. Then they, they, they got bought out by Alstom, didn't they? So now they're like, ooh, I, I never noticed that before. I really like the Columbus Circle, the, the shiny ceramic outlined by the matte border ceramic tiles. I like that. One minute, wow, oh wait, oh no. No, 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 is it gonna be? Okay, come on. Fingers crossed for a 160. Come on. Come on. Come on, A. Come on, A-Train. You can do this. By the way, the uh, Super Toe High Tops here, also available at gogosupertoe.com. You will not get them before Christmas, so don't even ask. Anyway. Oh, and if you buy the High Tops, get one size up and get some really nice insoles, because 
the sole is kind of thin. I didn't increase the quality, but I was able to decrease the price to make them accessible for everybody. Financially accessible for everybody. Why is this one orange and the other ones are red? Weird. Why was that light orange? I guess they, they needed to replace it and like, Hey! Hey! Johnny! What? We're out of the red! Yeah, just throw in the orange. The orange is just as close. It's good enough. They'll understand. Okay, Johnny, you're right. <laughs> that was my impression of um, the uh, transit worker union repair people at the MTA. You, you get it. That was my impression of the workshop. Guys, Johnny and let's say Sal. <laughs> There's my- I just made two characters. Hey, actually, I'll bet there is a Johnny and a Sal working- Hey, Johnny and Sal, if you're watching this right now, then, um, you know, leave a shout out and leave a shout out to you and leave in the comments. Hey, I'm Sal, I work at this MTA train yard. I- I installed that light. <laughs> 125. This is a great transfer point, but I'm not transferring here. Taking the A, and by the way, I think we all knew it was going to be R46 because it's 2020, so why would it be anything but? Oh, secret door! Nice emergency exit there. Pretty cool. That wasn't a. No, that wasn't a platform. That was a. That was emergency exit, right? Not like a abandoned platform or anything. Okay. So here's one, four, five, koozies. Come on, let me out, let me out. Gotta get, gotta transfer to the D train. To the Bronx. We're almost there. Almost there. A train doesn't go to the Bronx, but the D train does. Mask, okay, okay, well, I forgot we gotta. Do we have to uptown on the Bronx, BD? Okay. So, oh, okay, I see. So, had to go to the different level. Not a, di okay, koozies. Man, 145 is a big stop, huh? One to Norwood. That's where we're going. Four minutes. From all who work at the MTA to all who ride the MTA, happy holidays. You know what, MTA? Happy holidays to you, too. You have had one heck of a 2020. And we, I just want to say from Super Toe and all his fans, we appreciate you, MTA. We appreciate all that you've done. Everybody who works for the MTA, everybody who coordinates, that guy right there who's walking away, we appreciate you. Holding it down, holding it strong. All right, so D train to Da Bronx. D is for Da Bronx. Okay, I'm going to stop saying Da Bronx now. Da Bronx. That was the last time. Sorry, it was like a cough. Like I had to get it out. Oh, my dude's asleep on the... Well, I hope he's... At least he's warm, because it's cold out there. Okay, so 145, I guess the next stop is... We're going to be in the Bronx at the next stop, right? 155. Wait a minute, is this... No. Is it? I'm pretty... Is, sh I can't remember. Pretty sure this is... Anyway, we're getting off at Yankees, and that's that's the that's the stop. That's we're changing at Yankee 161. I think I'm pretty sure 155 is in the Bronx. I'm not looking at my map right now. You, you guys see? You guys see why I asked you to take me to the Bronx? Because I haven't been here forever. I know nothing. I know nothing about the stops here. Oh man! But it's good to be back. Oh, and I get to see Yankee Stadium again. That's cool. I think that's a that's a pretty stadium. The area around it's really pretty too. But we're not like actually walking through it. 161 Street River. I really like the gradient outline, the the gradient uh, orange on the borders of that 161. They renovated this station recently, didn't they? It's nice. Whoa, this is cool. Look at that. It's like a tree growing through the wall almost, and it's like broken apart the wall, but in an artistic, purposeful fat. Oh wow, I like it. I like that. That is so cool. That's such a cool idea. It's like a piece of the wall broke off. And show it. Nice. Alright, that's a, I like that. Man, that's... That was like incorporating... That really... That's not just like throwing up a design. That's incorporating the design into the design of the station. I just love that. Alright, so... Here we are, waiting for the D-Train to go to... 
somewhere. I don't know where. That's a pretty interesting structure. I guess there's supposed to be a water tower on top of that. Anyway, there's Yankee Stadium. Let's get a nice good look at that. Poor, empty Yankee Stadium. I mean, it's not baseball season or anything, but uh, still. Okay. So we're waiting for the four train now. There's a four train. Uh, salt. Oh, yeah, it's supposed to snow today, right? I mean, not, I mean today or tonight, tomorrow. Sometime. Anyway, sometime soon it's supposed to snow. Don't want to get the shoes salty. Uh huh. Oh. So what is that structure? It looks like it's supposed to have a water tower or something at the top of it, but right, but really right now it just looks like a watchtower. Like it looks like it should have somebody up there, like a an old-fashioned guard, like guard as a guard tower, just standing up there, ready to light the torch whenever the enemy uh, approaches. I watch too many movies. Car number twelve o two. Hey, you know, I asked how high the numbers go on the 160s. And he's a Manhattan bound four train. The next stop is 149th. Grand How low do the numbers go on these? Because I think this might. Now I've ridden like 1,000 and some being before. Boo being held in the station by the train's dispatcher, moving shortly. I'm going to speed it up some. I don't have time to wait around. Got places to go. Any time now. Come on, close it up. Close it up. You can do it. Stand clear of the closing doors, please. That's right. I'm standing clear. Bye, 161 Yankees. I don't think I've been to the four platform at 161 before. Hmm. Whoa, nice view. That's pretty. Well, the Bronx is nice looking. I like that. We're around Yankee Stadium, obviously. Look at all the giant parking garage there for people who want to drive. Alright, on we go. So, still got two more. Two and five. So we're going to ride the two and the five, but we're going to ride the two first. So we had to take the four back down a little bit. Now we're going to take the two back up. Hmm. Where is the... Oh, that's right. We got to go back up, so I have to change platforms. So I got to go up here and over here and then down. All right, cool. So this one goes back uptown. Excellent. And Oh, wow. And then I have to go down again and over here. Wow, this is like... This is a big... Oh, nasty! NYC Central, man, that's a... Haven't seen a mosaic installation that bad off for a while. A mo uh, station identifier. I hope this one's on the list. I hope this one's on the list, MTA. Make a note. 149 really, really needs a facelift. Although I do, don't facelift this. Repair it, because I really like the matte mosaic here. It's... I really like how that looks. It's pretty. It throw, you know, the shiny the shiny tiles are great and all, and probably easy to clean. But those matte, it's just, I don't know, it gives it a nice earthy feel. I like it. Let's get a nice look at it. There. Oh, there's a guy. I want to do an empty train dance. But there's a guy there. Heh. <sighs> Whatever. So, where are we going now? We're going to transfer. Oh, yeah, that's right. So I'm in the front, uh, I'm in the first car because we're transferring at W Farm Square, East Tremont. And uh, McLean, Mr. McLean made it very clear that I should be in the front first car because apparently there is an old track we can see when we get to W Farms. So apparently there is a there is a old track we can see that used to, that leads to what used to be the 180th Street station. So we're going to check that out when we get there. I'm standing clear. Okay, so we're on the front first car. It's going to be a little bit before we get there, but we will definitely get there. Let's see. That's a pretty cool view. Uh, still, I don't like how 
I, I would really like to get a clear view shot out the front. It'll be so nice to get a POV. But no more of that. The 42s and 32s are gone, Zs. So no more clear shots out the front window or back window. Let's see. Ah, yeah, the other side's too sunny. I'm gonna look out this side. Like, the, sun is, the low sun is really hitting. Oh, Jackson Avenue. You know what? Somebody had a good idea for, probably for next year is probably is when I'll do it. Um, I forget who had the idea, but decal to decal. I think I wanted. I want to start doing. I want to start doing like uh, same name stations, but in different parts of the city, like decalb in on the L to decalb on the Q N. I mean, not, sorry, the Q R B. And then there's Jackson Avenue. We just passed, and there's a Jackson on the seven, right? And. So, like, the number streets are easy, but the name streets, that would be interesting. Like, there's, I think there's two Nostrands. I want to say there's Intervale Avenue. I've been there before. I went to Intervale last time we came here, didn't I? Or Simpson. Or both. I can't remember. Uh-oh, honking. Yep, there's a guy up there. They're working on the tracks. That's what the honk means. The honk means, hey, I'm a train, in case you didn't see me. That's what it's saying. That's... And there's my guy off the tracks. Good job. Okay. These guys are pros. I mean, obviously, the, they know how dangerous it is, and they go through extensive training to make sure that they take proper precautions. Accident lawyers. They, did you see that Y in accident lawyers? Like, they just replaced that Y with a brand new spanking shiny Y, but not the rest of the sign. They couldn't afford to replace the rest of the sign. Just the Y. Makes you wonder why they couldn't replace the rest of the sign, doesn't it? So not very busy. That's it. Standing clear, thank you for the warning. Alright, back out the easy to see. The windows are not clean, so it, when the sun's shining directly in your face, not easy to see out them. Simpson Street, Coolsies. Hey, it's a nice. <laughs> that dude got his electric bike all the way up. What is this? Oh, I'll do the little sparrow birdie. Hey, Mr. Birdie. Eating that. Eat that. Oh, he chased the bird. He lost it. You can get it. There we go. Okay. Bird's got to eat too. Oh, my dude's still just chilling there. I wonder, wonder if he's sleeping or something. Like, I wonder if he plans to take the. Like, get off at the last stop. Let me have an empty train car, dude. Freeman Street. Maybe I should do guy asleep and unaware dance. Oh, hey, guy. Got his red flag. Dude, he's standing between the rail, between, like, the electrified rails. That is dangerous AF. Lots of, lots of people working on this track. That's cool. I don't know, man. Like, why? Hey guys, just sitting there talking with your hands. More honking, so there's more guys up here, huh? Looks like they're fixing the outside of that building or doing something to it. Anyway, back out this side. Another train. That's a. Is that a two or a five? too bright. I can't see. You probably know. And it's a five. Okay, cool. That's a, That's the next one we get to. Raised rails are the best. Wow, they're really, they are really doing, like, doing something. Plaza del Castillo. That's Plaza of the Castle? I, Castillo, is that what castle? I, I don't speak, I only know a few words in Spanish, so maybe you should clue me in and down in the comments. 174, I think we're almost there. There's another five. Wow, how do these... Yes. West, that's a long station name. West Farm Square, East Tremont Avenue. Man. All right, cool. So we're transferring it the next, and we'll look for that... Um, we'll look for that uh, track that goes to, that used to go to the 180th Street Station. 
More guys standing in the middle of the trip. Is this an express? What, is that? An, why is there a middle track? Is there an? Oh wow! Look at them go! Wow, they're they're doing some serious. They must have they must have deactivated those rails. They had to have. They must have deactivated the the um. I don't know. They couldn't have though. All right, so here we are. Nice stained glass here. This is officially the deepest into the Bronx I think I've ever been. Uh, I don't see what he's talking about. All right, Mr. McLean, if you're watching, tell me what I'm looking for because all I see is a bunch of taxi cabs. I mean, it's nice. It's a nice view. Hmm. Curves right. Oh, there he goes. The two train will curve right off. Hmm. But it doesn't. I don't see any. Yeah. Okay. There's my guys just sort of chilling there. Okay, so he's got the flag in the middle of the red flag in the middle of the track. So that means no trains are allowed to come. But no trains are coming just yet. It's just the two train heading still heading off to its final destination, wherever that is. Two forty-one, two something. All right, one set. So, is there anything I can see out? All right, I'm just looking because I didn't research this. I just took uh, took his word for it. West Fun. Nah, not gonna East Tremont Avenue, Bronx. Oh, the Bronx Zoo is here. Okay, still chilling there. Nope, I'm waving that flag. No go for whatever trains are coming. All right, well, I'm probably gonna have to just sort of. Yep, still. I'm probably gonna have to cut here soon because just wait for the five. Oh, there is a train. Look, he's waving. He's like, nope, nope. Oh, no, he's like, go. Okay, he's letting it go. Okay, there it goes. He said it's cool. We're cool. We're cool. You can go now. Nice. Nice to watch them in action. He's got to make sure that's got to make sure that the coast is clear. East Tremont. Say, all right, I'm just gonna cut and see. Wait till the five train. Dude, that guy just went out into. <laughs> look, look. Okay, you're gonna have to rewind it from the beginning. That 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 guy just went out and talked to the guy. Guy, he went straight out on the tracks. To talk to that dude. Can't hear what he's saying. He looks aggressive. And the if you saw the MTA guy was like, I don't know what's going on to the train operator. What is okay now he, he looks like he's about ready to jump down onto the tracks. What's going on? I don't Oh. Uh oh. Oh, they're on their way. They're gonna they're gonna, uh, oh, this is, this is gonna turn, uh, hopefully it doesn't turn ugly. It's not, I'm sure they're trained for such situations. No, oh, dude, the language man, language. You're lighting a cigarette. Is that what he's doing? Yeah, this dude's just out looking for trouble. Looks like he got it. Found it. Here comes my dude. Oh, no, no, he's like, he's not, okay, he's not trying to talk to him, good. He's trying to make sure he's talking to his own guys, make sure everything's good. This is crazy. I wish you guys had seen. I didn't start the camera, but that dude went straight on the tracks, talked to the guy holding the flag for about a minute or like thirty seconds, then came right back up, like he like he works there. This dude's this dude's body language is so I can't hear what he's saying, but not cool, man. I think she's being friendly. She's like. I think she's asking like aren't there, isn't that dangerous to stand between the electrified tracks? Why are they walking? <laughs> okay, all right. All right. Looks like the show's over. Whew, that was weird. All right, back to it. Man, drama in the Bronx. Rumble in the Bronx, not really a rumble though. They handled that good. The MTA workers they they did not non aggressive. They got it all worked out. I don't think my dude wanted to really start trouble, and neither did they. They showed their numbers, and it all worked out. Okay, cool. Good. Good. Good reaction. But the, hey, <laughs> welcome to the Bronx. See, he's got his foot propped right up on the third rail. Come on, dude. 
that's you know, like I don't know what I'm talking about because I don't work there, but that looks dangerous. It looks dangerous. All right, we're on the last leg of the journey, the five train. Wee! So we're going to the last stop, which is definitely the furthest I've ever been into the Bronx. So, and I've never been to the station, East Chester Dyer Avenue. So it'll be a first for me. Cool, okay, so, oh, more guys. <laughs> I, there is a construction facility here. Look at that. I did not know that. That's pretty cool. And a bunch of guys, oh, MTA, mask up. There you go, all masked up, awesome. Look at them. So mostly social distancing and completely masked up. Props. Loris, more Morris Park, Morris Park is next. <laughs> Are you pointing at me? You pointing at, pointing at me? He's like, ah, forget about it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> don't worry about him. Bombardier! Again! Boy, Bombardier's been good to us today. There's a little eye reveal. One eye, you get one eye. That's all. Get it, buy this. You, you gotta buy the hat for seeing that eye. Just kidding. Oh! Oh, this is it! This is it, isn't it? This is the, is this the track that goes to the old 180th Street station that, uh, that we're he was talking about? I think this is it. Leave in the comments. Is this it? It doesn't? Uh, it looks like those tracks are in use though. Yes, yeah, alright, I don't really know. I probably should have researched it, but I didn't. But the third the third rail still it just runs out. It wasn't it like stops. I don't know. Uh, you're just gonna have to tell me what I'm supposed to be looking at. Put a time marker in there. Like if I if you saw the the 180th Street old tracks that Eric McLean was talking about, then leave a time stamp in the comments and let me know what I'm supposed to be looking at. Anyway, so we're past that, and we're on to Tremont. Almost there. Huh. There's a whole, looks, is it, is like the whole station built over this, the tracks here? Weird. Huh. What an interesting structure, this. What an interest. So I guess they had to because this train is actually on ground level. It's not raised. Morris Park. Oh, we're if we're officially. Yep, we're officially past transfers to the two. Actually, that's not what that. That's not how that reads. The two and the five split off a while back. I will, but I'm not exiting. BX12. Yeah, I'm not doing that though. Nice. Nice station. I mean, haven't been to Gun Hill Road before. Nice. Boy, the Bronx is. I won't, you know, the Bronx is the Bronx. It's. <laughs> Pelham Bay Parkway. I, man. Thanks for taking me here. Like, I just have never been to any of these stations before. And this, this place this practically looks like a Metro North ride right now. Look at that. It's like houses and stuff. Gun Hill Road. Gun Hill Road. What a name for a road. Looks like your closet's open. I can see inside. Baychester Avenue. East Chester, Bay Chester. How many Chesters are there? Like, Chester is very popular to have so many stations named after him. <laughs> East Chester, West Chester, Bay Chester. Super Chester. Super Toe Chester. That's, that's what I'm, I'm gonna name a station. I'm gonna make my own map and write in a station that says Super Toe Chester. East Super Toe Street. <laughs> This is Baychester Avenue. Yep, yep it is. I guess, it, is this neighborhood called Baychester? 
Yay, we go from e Baychester to Eastchester. Wow, this is, uh, I guess this is the only, rate, only way to get by train to this part of the Bronx, so that is why there seems to be a lot of, a good number of people getting off the train. Uh-oh, more stuff. Wonk, wonk. That was the train here, honk. The train said, train here. There's my guy, got out of the way, just chilling. Cool. More guys, just chilling. Social distancing with masks. Gotta say, keeping New York safe. That's what they're doing. And moving, keeping it moving. Nice. Okay, last stop. So I guess we actually have to go down to, or is it down? Are we at ground level? Or we? No, I think I think this one's raised rail. So yeah, we gotta we gotta go down and see what's up. Get it? Go down and see what's up. Do not enter. Definitely, it's like they really don't want you to enter. They put two signs there. Three signs. Do not enter at all. All right. Cool. There's a five train. Looks like it's about to take off. Dyer Avenue. I guess Dyer's the name, not East Chester. Whatever. East Chester's the neighborhood. Dyer Avenue's the name of the road. Studio. Oh, he's on his phone. I thought he had his head down. <laughs> Mask up. That's right. Thank you for that message, MTA. Bye, five train. The other five train that's going back. Cool. So we get to check. I get to check out the Bronx. What is, what is that? All right. What's up? Let's get out there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna act like I belong here. Hey, I'm walking here. There's a fruit stand. What's up, Bronx? What's up? Yeah, the Bronx. I, the, sorry. That was, <laughs> that was a bad impression. I'm under the train tracks. Woo! Okay, cool. Well then, this is the Bronx. It looks like it could be pretty much anywhere USA except for that graffiti fence there. I kind of like that. That's actually kind of adds personality to the fence. Quite like it. The P corner there, not so much. Um, so I'm just going to sign off in front of the graffiti wall there and that's all for warrior 2 now 2020 don't forget to subscribe there'll be some more episodes coming but i will be taking no more requests for where to now until i restart it next year hopefully with an all trains video stay safe out there and mask up